Hey everybody, welcome back to Brandon's Ballistics. I'm your host, Brandon Barker, and today I'm doing a gun unboxing. Yeah, I went in and got another gun. Big surprise, right? <laughs> so uh, this time I picked up another Taurus. So it's falling out. Uh, some people aren't a big fan of Taurus. I am. Uh, and uh, they're a good budget gun. You can you can have a lot of fun with their firearms. You know. You, Yes, they ain't going to last you as long as, you know, a more expensive gun. You know, it, you know, they're not going to last as long as, like, a Glock or something like that. But for what they are, they're awesome, okay? You, know, it, it, you don't spend three, four hundred dollars on a gun and expect, you know, a thousand dollar quality. Uh, once again, I started recording, and he wants to come be, you know, a little tension hog. Ain't your butt big. And throw stuff in the floor. So, looks like I've already got the paperwork that came out of the Taurus. So, uh, for anybody interested, here's a coupon for uh, $5 uh, off of a, looks like a, can't tell what you got $5 off of. Uh, Taurus Judge bag with shell holder. With shell holder. Uh, normally $14.99, but on sale for $9.99, use promo code BAGS. And then also, uh, $10 off of a Taurus Judge uh, holster. Uh, sell $34.99, uh, normally $44.99. Use promo code HOLSTER10. I guess my fingernails, my fingernails are dirty. Uh, yeah, I know the ATF stuff. Owner's manual, and since we've, you know, I've said Taurus Judge a couple times, well, you can kind of know what I've got. A Taurus Judge, three inch version. Let's go ahead and get that out of the way so you can kind of see the sight. Go ahead and get that little protector out. And knife time. Alrighty. That just feels good. I've always wanted the Taurus Judge. I, uh, every time that somebody would show me one, I was... I knew one of these days I'd get one. Uh, it's just the, the idea of shooting 410 uh, or 45 Long Colt. You know, uh, out of a pistol, it just seems fun. Uh, speaking of 410, I bought some spicy 410. Uh, I got triple ock, triple ock buck, got four, triple ock buck. It's hard for me to say that. Uh, 410 shells to shoot through this when we take it out in the range. I also got 45 Long Colt. So, uh, yeah, we'll be able to throw it through our paces. I bought uh, two boxes of 45 Long Colt, and uh, I got a box of regular 410 shells and a five pack of the Triple Watt Buck. Because I want to see how well Triple Watt Buck shoots out of this. Um, I'm guessing with the short barrel, it's, you know, it's going to, you know, I, I'm not looking for distance, but, uh, you know, I, I need to find a fun target to shoot it with. But yeah, you know, it's the 3 version, so you have the, you know, Hopefully, everything's sticking together further down. Hopefully, you get a little more distance. But this looks awesome. I mean, you know, big old revolver. Of course, you get that uh, huge cylinder. The <laughs> uh, chamber of 410, uh, 45 long colt. So, uh, yeah, it's a five shot. Double action, single action. And that single action, see how it is. That's actually really good. Um, let me see if I can do it where you can see. So you can kind of see the movement, hardly any. And so yeah, there's not much slop in this gun. Uh, of course it is brand new. I don't know if it will hold up to that. I guess we'll find out. Uh, before I do the full review on it, I'm gonna put it in. I mean, like, I, only got, I only have 100 rounds uh, total of 45 Long Colt. And about, uh, I don't know how much box, how many is in a box of 410. So uh, a box of 410 and then the, the uh, triple watt buck 410. So I don't have a whole lot of ammo to be able to do the full review on. So, uh, yeah. Uh, but, you know, I, I, I'll make sure to put her through her paces to be able to give, you know, a good indication of how she is. We have the full grip. So, uh, you know, it, it's not one of those grips where your pinky's just hanging off the side. You get the full grip, which, you know, for this gun, I would assume you would want. Uh, yeah. Nice little thing to be able to protect you know, your front sight. And I, for a long time, I actually didn't. Because uh, every time I bought a new gun, these were off of it, and I never knew what this was for. 
So when I when I bought this one, it was on. It, it finally dawned on me. Oh, that's what it's for. Uh, there, uh, this also comes with uh, a couple tools inside. Allen wrench and uh, the Taurus branded, you know, keys. And is that it? Yes, that is it. So, uh, yeah, yeah, beefy little owner's manual. As far as I've been able to see, you can shoot any 410 uh, shell out of this. Uh, or at least it's what I've seen on the internet. And as we know, if it's on the if it's on the internet, it must be true. And my cat's getting and knock off a bunch of boxes. Thank you, Bubby. I'll pick that up later. But yeah, this is, uh, it's, I don't know if it's just because it's new or what, but it's just so smooth. The double action, it's, you know, it's a heavy double action pull. Don't get me wrong. But double action is not supposed to be, you know, hair trigger. Double action is almost a, you know, good thing about double action, you, instead of carrying, you know, cocked and locked and then ready to fire with that nice, easy single action pull, you, you can have a, uh, you can carry full cylinder, I don't know, a new revolver that has, uh, you know, that protection in it to where if the hammer's hit, it won't go off. But uh, it makes it to where it's unlikely something in your pocket's going to accidentally pull the trigger versus if it's cocked and locked, you know, it's very, it's a lot easier for something to accidentally pull the trigger. And uh, you don't want something like this going off uh, in your pocket without you knowing it. Because, <laughs> well, you'll know it very quickly. <laughs> you'll be aware of it and everybody around you will be aware of it. Not to mention you're screaming. So, uh, yeah, I can't wait to get this out of the range and shoot. I've been looking forward to getting one of these in a long time. I know I've never shot one. Uh, I purposely waited. Uh, every time somebody asked me if I, if I wanted to shoot theirs, I'm like, no, I want to wait until I shoot the one I own. Or want to do on one. Yes, it is the actual judge. I need to get the uh, the other ones. The smaller version, I like, uh, can't remember, the circuit court. Or uh, I can't remember what it's called, but it's uh, the, the different versions of it. Uh, I, wonder they, I wonder if they make one that shoots 12 gauge or 20 gauge uh, or 16 gauge or yeah, you know, all the different ones. <laughs> but yeah, um, my first impressions are keep in mind. Uh, I mean, even for a Taurus, this is uh, impressive. Uh, it's impressive looking. Yeah, I don't think anybody can uh, deny that. They see something, you know, this big old revolver, it's impressive looking. Uh, it's honestly, a, I mean, it's a little heavy, but not bad, which makes me kind of worry about the recoil. <laughs> but, I mean, it's heavy enough that it should be all right. Got the long barrel on it, so that keeps some of the weight forward. But, yeah, so what do you think on this uh, little unboxing here? Uh, I know some people hate the Taurus Judge. Some people like the Taurus Judge. Uh, as a defensive gun, I don't think I'd ever use this for self-defense. I'm going to tell you why. 410. It's not because 410 is underpowered. Uh, it really depends on your loading. I guess 410 slug wouldn't be too bad, but then why not just go ahead and use the 45 Long Colt? If you're going to use 410 uh, Birdshot or Buckshot, the bad thing about using that in self-defense is let's say you do use it in self-defense and you know almost all the pellets hit your intended target but one doesn't well uh even when, even when you're in a fight for your life you are responsible for each and every one of those pellets so if one of those pellets one of those goes off and hits somebody innocent or destroys property or does anything that other than hit the target that you want to hit you are legally responsible for that so you could have been you know completely legal and you know and firing your gun in self-defense but because of the spread of that 410 shot well you can go to prison for the rest of your life for manslaughter or murder depending on how the uh, jury sees it and then you'll lose your gun rights for life and etc 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 so yeah i don't see this as a self-defense firearm could it be used for one absolutely uh, of course it could but should you use it for one i mean that's my personal thoughts uh, everybody's left up to make their own decisions. That's just, you know, my thoughts on it and my justification to why I wouldn't use this for self-defense unless I was firing 45 long colt or slugs out of this. But, you know, once again, if I was going to fire 410 slugs, I would just assume to fire, you know, 45 long colt instead. So, yeah. Fun gun. Definitely fun to have on a range. Fun to be able to play around with. Uh, once again, it's a gun that you can have 
fun with. Uh, as I say in uh, you know some other videos, you can have fun with firearms as long as it's legal, as long as it's safe. And you know, horse, while they are budget friendly, they do make decent firearms. Yes, I do consider this a safe firearm. And firing four ten pistol is just fun. So uh, you know, like I said, it, uh, it's up to you if you would want to use it for self defense. That's just not something that I personally want to uh, to do. But of course, you know, that also leads on to, well, does that mean you wouldn't, wouldn't use 12 gauge for self-defense? And well, it depends on the situation. I mean, sure, if, if my life is getting to an end, I would rather be, I'm sure I'll see this, I'm sure, I'm sure I'll see this in the comments. I'd rather be judged by a 12 than carried by a six. So uh, how about neither? I would I would rather, because it's, it's possible to be judged by a 12 and then carried by a six. Uh, it's not an either, an either or thing. It can be both and it can be none. Uh, I'd rather it be none, uh, neither one of those things. So uh, hopefully, you know, everybody watching this uh, never gets into a situation where you have to use a firearm in self-defense. But if you do, hopefully either there's nobody around your target to where this right here, you know, that everything that comes out of this firearm hits your intended target, or you have a firearm that it's a lot easier for that to, uh, for you to accomplish that, you know, goal. But yeah. I was going to go and wrap this up. So if you liked this gun, if you like this video, make sure to leave a like on the video. I, uh, that helps this channel out immensely. Uh, go ahead and leave a comment down below. Do you have a Taurus judge? Uh, how do you like it? Is it something that you would use for self-defense? And and if it is, leave a justification down below. Uh, if it is or if it's not. I want to hear both sides of this. You know, you've heard my side. Once again, as I say, I'm not an expert. I'm an enthusiast. So, uh, you know, I, I like to hear other people's opinions on things as well. That's just my opinion, one of many. So, uh, yeah, definitely leave, it, leave that down in the comments. Uh, make sure to share this video around with your friends and family. And definitely, definitely be subscribed. Check to make sure you're... Ooh, I almost forgot code word. So, code word. Judge. J-U-D-G-E. Judge. Code word is judge. I almost forgot it. So, yeah, I would have... Anytime I forget a code word... It's going to be in the description of that video. So uh, if you're watching the video and you didn't see a code word, didn't hear a code word, uh, just look in the description. It should be there. If not, leave a comment. And if that, because sometimes I release multiple videos in a day and only one video has a code word, then I might as well. But anyway, that's near this through there. Uh, one final thing. Uh, speaking of, and I don't see it. Aha, there it is. Uh, speaking of promo codes, um, one more time. If if anybody wants to watch uh, Vet TV, you get one month free. Which again, I am not sponsored, but you can use promo code TACPACNOV22 to get one month free of Vet TV. If you haven't watched The Grunts Life, you are missing out. Uh, it is not safe for work. Uh, do not watch it at work. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely don't watch it with work. Uh, unless your boss is an awesome fella from the military. Fella or f fella uh, you know, from the military, and they can, you know, have that, you know, crude sense of humor. Then maybe they'll be all right with it. But uh, it doesn't matter if you are an ex-military or not. I am not ex-military, but that doesn't mean I can't enjoy it. So uh, definitely check out Vet TV. Get yourself one month free. Uh, if you would end up, you know, actually buying it, Say that you've heard, you know, that you heard about it from Brandon's Ballistics. Once again, I'm not sponsored. They don't know anything about me. But maybe if they start hearing about my channel, they might send me a message. So, <laughs> but yeah, I appreciate y'all stopping by. I'm sure Ali Bear appreciates you too. Look that way. No, no, look that way. <laughs> you don't look at the camera. <laughs> and I will see you next time. Peace.